This young lady, Riley McCusker, who on her best event, the bars, fell. And let's see how she can finish up her all-around competition today. And she can perform this exquisitely. She has such polish. Oh, big bounce out of that full in. I think she might have stayed right on the line. Hard to say. Nice stretch into that front tuck and stag jump. That's as well as she's performed that all week. Beautiful angle to see exactly how that leap should be performed. She made the triple wolf. Big, big points there. Lovely position in the air on those leaps. Oh. There's the landing. And picture perfect poses. I wish you'd hold that in position just a little longer. So it's gorgeous. Soak it in. But throughout the entire performance, you could take snapshots and have gorgeous cover magazine photos of her poses. Now my amateur scribbles on the paper indicate to me that for her to get more than a 13.65, she could move into first in the all around because Ellie Black opened the door with the mistake she had on floor. With the exception of that first tumbling pass landing, which she did just stay on the line, it looks like. It was a, uh, that was the most significant deduction. The rest of the routine was close to flawless. Proud mama there. I tell you what, she has every reason to be proud. When you see your daughter, or any athlete really, have a mistake, know they're disappointed but come back strong that's what you want to see the resiliency of these athletes is remarkable good for them very proud of them this score will be interesting ellie black the leader with a 55 25 flavia saraiva a 54 35 she went ahead of kara eaker with a 53 75 so saraiva and black assured of medals but what color it is depends on the number we're going to see now. According to my calculations, anything more than a 13.65 for Riley McCusker. And remember, she had a 14.05 in the qualifying round. That would give her the gold medal. Can I trust your math? Not Ooh, sure. We'll Just see. scratching away here on my iPhone, Kathy. Perfect landing there. Gorgeous.